film here. I did. I did. I'm Brian O'Donnell, and I wrote, co-directed, and co-produced a film called Akron. I've heard very good things about it. I'm glad to hear that. Has it gotten other awards? Uh, it has. Yeah, we've been uh, in the festival circuit for a little over a year now, uh, and we've won 10 awards. We've won um, audience awards and uh, jury awards, so we've been very, very blessed. We've been lucky. How did you happen? Is this something you made? Are you a filmmaker by profession, or was it made as an actor? Uh, this is my first film. My co-producing and co-directing partner uh, is based in Ireland. Her name is Sasha King, and she's uh, worked in film for years. Uh, I come from the playwriting world years ago, but I've been in the nonprofit world for a bunch of years working at Broadway Cares, Calamus Foundation, but this script came to me and uh, the project all came together, so this is my first film. Oh, I tell you, it's such a, a turkey shoot, you never know, but you You see, never do know. And I mean, the festival circuit, it's so funny because it's such a small world now, festival circuits, I mean... Most films are never seen except ultimately on Logo or Sundance or it's, Netflix, it's, I've learned Netflix. I've learned a lot on this journey. Uh, yes. It's, it's, I hope you haven't lost your shirt. I know people that made a movie called The Dog, the documentary, and they put a lot of money into that and then the distributors screwed them because they only put in a few film festivals and it's available, you know, through uh, Amazon. Okay. You get on Amazon for nothing. But I mean it got great reviews everywhere. Yeah, we we're, we're doing well. We're happy with where we are right now. We, we did get how, distribution. How would you describe your movie? How, how, what genre? Uh, it's a love story. It's a family drama. It's a story about two college freshmen, two guys who meet and fall in love with each other. Uh, but what's different about our film is that the, the, the drama doesn't come from the fact that they're gay. They're both out. They're both happy. Their family and friends accept them. The drama comes because there was a tragic accident involving their mothers I when they were that. very little. I, rem I remember reading the description because okay. I have your film marked as one to go to. Okay. I can't swear that I bought the ticket yet. When is it playing? It's, uh, we're screening on Saturday, but we actually sold out. But they gave us an encore screening so you can come to the Tuesday evening screening, and that's at the center. Oh, wow. Yeah. Wow. Sold out. That's we great. Sold out, yeah. I came, I came two days ago to try to get pictures and uh, think of the 23rd Street because I didn't know how to deal with Ticketmaster, you know, and I was okay. a member too. Okay. And I, I didn't have the program. I finally have managed to get here tonight. I got. The, I really want to get that special movie tomorrow night, that 1921. Right? Yes, Just that nice. looks fascinating. We are different. Yeah, here. you're not going to see that anywhere. No, I don't think so. Right. And will your film eventually be on Netflix? Or it will. It will. And how? What period of time will it take? Well, we're going to be released on DVD and video on demand in uh, February next year. And then uh, Netflix will follow. I don't. We don't have a date yet, but it'll follow soon after. I have no business answering this, asking this. But what the financing? What kind of financing? What would you uh, say is a? I'll is just a, say. I'll not just say. Not like yours. You could just say generally in the in the film, the gay film world. I know it can be anything. I'll we just say low budget. I'll just say low budget. I mean low budget. <laughs> I, I know people that made low budget. They consider some people. Marsha B. Johnson was made for eight thousand dollars, but it was all volunteer labor. Yeah, and, and very little. Well, we had to pay actors. We had to pay. We couldn't do it for eight thousand, but but um, it was low budget. I won't give any details about it. No, but I'm just saying. I know people that spent a hundred thousand dollars or more and lost their shirts because yeah. they couldn't get the distribution. Yeah. I mean, don't, what do you think is an average budget for a movie? Is that what you were I, I'm new in this game, so I don't really you even... haven't talked to other filmmakers? Uh, not about their budgets. Oh! <laughs> I sort of like asking like, how much money you have. Because <laughs> you lend me a subway token so I can go home? <laughs> exactly. <laughs> okay, well, thank you very much. You're very welcome. I'll put this on YouTube. That's fun. Thank you. Okay, thank you. The name again is? Brian O'Donnell. The film is Akron. A-K-R-O-N. A-K-R-O-N. City in Ohio. Oh, Ohio. Wonderful. Thank you. Thank you.